Hello everyone and welcome to a video of Farm Simulator 17. We're on Sutton Farms by Chris7710, but I've done an edit to it. A pretty massively big edit. Um, but yeah, I'll get to that in a second. But first I'd just like to say this is kind of my first YouTube video and I'm still kind of setting this up. So hopefully this all goes well and you know we kind of work through this together and get it all sorted. But yeah. Of course, I'm running Seasons mod. We're on the first of spring today, so that means we've got some sp spring work to do, such as like ploughing and fertilizer spreading and that whatnot. But yeah, um, so we'll be cranking up to that, cranking up and doing that shortly. But first, I'll just like to run through my equipment. I haven't really done much on this save game except for um, fertilize a couple of fields, but. But yeah, we'll be cranking up and doing a bit more of that soon, but I'll run through my equipment first and kind of give a bit of an overlook to the map and show you guys what's going on, but first thing I'll do is open up this and I'll show the PDA, so we kind of got a big, big farm, we got, these are all kind of the big fields and we've got a variety of grass fields over here and, you know, I've added more roads and, you know, all this stuff in the town, but we'll get to all that later because that's not, you know, irrelevant right now. But, um, but yeah, so the starting equipment I am using is we got we're rocking with the in game fork, we got the in game plow, a couple of weights, we got the in game baler, uh, we got the pickup, we got the coon planter. Coon axes 4.2 fertilizer spreader, um, coon sprayer, a couple of trailers, a slurry t uh, holding tank, which is a placeable item, but that comes with the map when you open it up. Um, a bale fork, a cavern mower, a uh, fertilizer trailer, fuel trailer, uh, the BC25 Marshall uh, 66 series which is 120 horsepower we got the uh, Massey Ferguson 5 square baler the Massey Ferguson 200 forage harvester New Holland TM 190 uh, New Holland TS 100 we got a bucket we got a set of forks we got a front loader uh, which I edited we got uh, the new Carry 820 which is just on Mod Hub we got the uh, contest class harvester and the header. Uh, we got the armor summon salmon cheater. Uh, what is that? That's a beat harvester, isn't it? Yeah, I'm pretty keen to use that. Haven't used that before. We got a weight. We got a direct drill. Um, that's in game one that's been edited a little bit. And we got the uh, 7700 series, which is 280 horse. So we kind of got a variety of equipment to get started. We'll be building up our equipment as we go and getting better things obviously but this is kind of what I've picked to start with which should be a good little good little setup for now as I take a sip of my coffee but yeah um, so I'll jump in and pick up alright right, yeah so this map I've been working on for a couple of months now I got seasons model working with it, but um, and all the snow masks. But yeah, we're kind of getting good lighting. I want to kind of. I've been messing around with the sky texture, so I'm just kind of working with that now. But um, yeah, added more roads and a village. We'll turn up here. Um, I've kind of relayed out the fields a bit. I've added animals and wildlife to the map and you know, wind turbines and hot air balloons and all sorts of different things. So we'll head up this hill here. Um, we're in the in game wizard here, nice interior. It's bloody automatic though, that's not good. <laughs> but um, we head up here, we got a little bit of a village. A village from here, we got a few houses. We've got a pub, sell your eggs, uh, you got more fields, uh, 
your shop in here where you can sell your grain to. Um, you have more village that I've added. You got kind of like a garden centre where you sell your bales. Um, more village. You got a service service station here. Nice BP. Um, added a church. More fields up here, so it kind of gets flat, and then you get a bit more hilly towards the end. But this is where you buy our animals up here. Um, yeah, so your slurry here, and you can buy your cows, and buy your pigs, and your sheep. Yeah, fix a few trees here, but I don't really come up here often. Do a quick Yui. Put it into the hedge there. We'll go back down this road. This road's pretty flat, it's pretty boring actually, it's probably not a good example, but we'll head down this road. This is where it starts getting good. We've got a couple of grass fields here. Big grass field here, massive big grass field. We'll be owning all them and working them. Bit of a laneway up to a few fields. Uh, in here is another little farmyard that I've added uh, where you can just store your bales and you know you can put your tractors. Um, I've added you know a bit of junk and I put a little water hole here to grab your water and then you open up to another grass field. So yeah. Probably won't use this farmyard much, but it's a nice little storage area. We'll keep rolling up along here. Got a few more of, uh, you know, apartments. We'll go off the road. A few more apartments and houses. A few more arable fields. These ones can start to get pretty big now as we start branching off up here. Twists and turns in the map. This one's a pretty big field. So yeah, it's an orange based farm, but it has big um, big fields to work. So this is a salt and sugar factory. So this is where you sell your sugar beets and potatoes. Um, in here, still a bit of work to do. That kind of annoys me. I need to line up a bit more. Yeah. Great demands for potatoes and sugar beets are here often, so I like this little safe one. I think it done a good job with this one. We'll continue up along here. Got a massive big grass field. Keep driving up here. More fields. Starts getting a bit more hilly. We have a car park in here, um, and then we come through a bit of a town, which I've added, added a few shops and that make it look a bit more realistic. We'll stop here and just get out. Um, as we, yeah, we have a, I've had a nice bit of a drain along too, nice murky creek. So you got more grassland here, so there's a lot of grass on the map to work, which is, should be fun. Pretty good multiplayer map. I know you guys probably don't really want to see a look around, but it's kind of exciting to see new things. Got a bridge, more fields, another road down there. We'll just keep going up this way. I'll just do a quick lap around the map so you kind of got you guys know what's going on. More fields. That one's a nice square one. better without seasons because of course all the crops are growing but with seasons makes it all harvested so Oop. crashing this one this is a BGA in here all working tip coals I've spent you know pretty much two days of my life working out tip coals and getting them all 100% working so they all work it's pretty a simple BGA but it works so
continue down here. A few more fields. This is one of your anim one of your atom farms. Technically, it's the pig farm. This is where the pigs are. Um, so I've added all this in. Um, your chickens are over here. So fully working eggs. Pick them all up. So yeah, it's a little yard in here where your chickens come. You got a laneway heading to them fields. Yeah, this is one of your, oh, stuck on the fence. This is one of your one of your few farms in here. You can sell your uh, store your crops so you don't have to drive all the way down to the main farm to get to feed your pigs because that's really annoying. Um, your big slurry pit. That's where your slurry goes from the pig pigs. You can mix it because you got a slurry ramp. Um, you got a shed. I've added all this in. You got more storage here. I've added all this storage. You know, bunkers. This is where your manure spawns in here. Pretty simple animal pig farm, if you ask me, but it looks nice. I'll do a quick Yui. Yui insurance. Head back up here. Turn down here. Just got another cell point here. And then fix trees again, but it's really so you grain. So you all here. Added the compost master with the map. All fully integrated with the map, all fully working. So yeah, you can add straw, grass, sugar beets, all that to the compost uh, compost master and turn it into fertilizers. Head back out here. This is where you start getting into the grass fields, this is where you start getting into animal farms. Head back down here, you've got more houses. All grass up here. This is kind of the grass area of the map. This is where you start getting into the, into the big stuff. We stop here. This is your sheep farm. So you feed your sheep here. You got sheds. You know, bunkers to store your grass. Machinery sheds. Piles of junk. More piles of junk. So yeah, they spawn in this area here. It's a nice big area for the um for the sheep. I wanted to make a nice big. Added this sheep and a few pens here to make it look a bit more realistic. They come into here. Pretty simple sheep farm, but it works. And then this is your cow farm. Uh, you got a simple shed here. You got all this. Got a workshop in here. This is where you can like edit your tractors and whatnot, customize them. You got a bale shed here. You got a silage pit, secret silage pit in this shed, which will be filling up. Tip coals work 100%. Um, you got a machine shed in here where you can store your machines. Um, I added this combine and all these tools to make it look like it's you know been there for a while. Another grass field there. Up here you come and you feed your cows along here, so come I made it so yeah you can drive through here and you feed them here. Oop, kept going under the ground. Um swim and you were spawns in here so you get it out of the shed. And then you've got a bit more storage. Storage comes all the way back to here. And then you've got a nice big, big slurry pit for the cows. Nice big 
Well, actually, you got two slurry pits, but they, usually, they only work as one. But nice slurry animations coming out of the pipe there. I think I did a good job on that. Good job on this slurry pit. I like it. It's probably one of the better ones I've done. I can't get out now. Good. I'm full slurry rants on them, so I can mix. Over here you got you know more storage old bunkers and sheds. You know you got open silage pit here. Holds about a million litres. Um, another place where you can feed your cows. They all walk through here, so it's kind of a simultaneous shed. Feed you know you got your water oop, you got your water trough. You know just a few calf decorations. Yeah, you drive through here. All your triggers are working. And then yeah, we're back over here, so that's that's the cow farm. I think it works good. Nice laid out. We we'll jump back in our in our Ute here. Head back down. So yeah, that includes a tour of the map. I guess we could kind of do some farming. Um, I don't know how long I've been recording for, but there's a few things I need to do. So we got the TM190 here with the spread on. Let's chuck the jump in this. So yeah, the map is private for now. I'm trying to work out a few bugs and get it all working, but I think I've got it all working. It's definitely playable. But yeah, I take no credit for the map. Tris seven seven ten did this. Uh, made made the map. Nathan sixty nine thirty. I want to say converted it. I just added the. I just made the extension. So yeah, I take no credit for making it. I just yeah, I just did my little personal. Personal bits. We'll try and grab both of these. Oh, that did not work. But yeah, hopefully, I can do a couple of videos. Videos on this map so you guys get to see what I'm doing. And feel free to leave some feedback. This is my first video, so. Uh, I'm still kind of working out the audio and like quality. I know it's probably not going to be that great, but as long as you can hear me, eh? As long as it works. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully I can get it all kinked out. Maybe the next episode will be better, but we're using seasons, so we're in first of spring. So we've got a lot of plowing and planting and fertilizer spreading and, and stuff to do, which should be exciting. I think I might leave it here, Nick. guys. I think you've kind of seen the first episode. Um, I hope I haven't, you know, messed it up completely. Um, feel free to leave some feedback. Tell me what I could do to improve it. Um, please leave a like. You know, do all that stuff for me. You know, it would be greatly appreciated. Um, yeah, please. You know, keep watching me videos because I'd really like if you did. And maybe a potential map release shall be upon you. But yeah, I think I'll leave it here. Thanks for watching me. We're on Sutton Farms by Chris7710. Um, I just edited it to my 
you know, taste a bit. But yeah, next episode we'll be actually doing some farming. I just did a map tour to kind of, so you guys kind of get the gist of what we're working with. But I hope that, you know, hope it all works and I'll wrap it up here. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you later.